C'est vrai que ça marchait tellement bien que ça en devient euh, presque inquiétant. had to go through that scene at the expo. Things didn't work out the way you expected, but everything's gonna turn out okay. See, I I know how this story turns out, and... The story is over. <gasps> ne faites pas n'importe quoi. Okay, Emmett, hold still. I know your emotions are running a little wild, but don't do anything crazy. <laughs> emotions? What emotions? My emotions are dead. They say I'm crazy, got no sense, but I don't care. They may or may not mean offense, but I don't care. Stop! What are you doing up here? Don't jump! I wasn't gonna jump! Uh, then what do you- This is where I come when I want to think. Oh. When I want to be alone. Oh. Dites-moi plus. What are you thinking about? Can't you take a hint? I don't want you here. I don't need you. You don't know what you need. And you do? As a matter of fact, yeah. You need... Vous allez prendre un sacré choc devant Frankenstein. Give your system a jolt. Taking a thriller, like... Frankenstein. Frankenstein. I tell you that my very life force is drained away, and you want to talk about Hollywood monster movies. It's a very inspirational monster movie. Especially the scene where they bring the monster to life. There's this big gurney that lifts him up into the air, and... And see, there's this wild storm going on, and lightning crashing everywhere. It's amazing. And you just gotta see it, Emmett. It'll change your life. Look at my helmet. Which light is flashing? Yellow. Apathy. I don't care about movies. I don't care about anything anymore. And I never will. Don't give me that. You care. Inventer est important pour vous. You still care about inventing things. <laughs> inventing is overrated. 99% hype, 10% fraud. Name one invention that ever did anybody any good. Uh, how about... Think about Edison and the light bulb. That was a great invention. Eh, yeah, might have been. If there was anything in this miserable world worth illuminating. Now what you... The automobile was a great invention, right? You love cars. Yes. If I'm lucky, I may be struck by one today. The telephone. telephone. Think how that invention has revolutionized the whole world. Yes. Now a person can be rejected long distance. Help me out here. You're getting on my nerves, Crockett. At least you would be if I still cared about anything. L'amour a de l'importance à vos yeux. Your heart's broken, I know. First breakup's a bitch, but you'll fall in love again, sooner or later. There's a woman waiting in the wings, and she's worth waiting for. Spare me the platitudes. Now that Edna has turned my heart into a desiccated husk, I'm done with love. Forever. Il a de l'importance à vos yeux. We're all depending on you to pull it together. Why? You're gonna put Hill Valley on the map. Oh, please. My greatest fear is that I'll end up frittering my life away in this miserable town. Ah. Uh, J'ai de l'importance à vos yeux. Me? You care about me, Doc? <laughs> you? Yeah. You. You did this to me. I did what? I was perfectly content drudging away in my dad's law office. You show up out of nowhere, get me all excited about inventing, and disappear. Two months later, you show up again, you trick me into making a hero out of myself and getting involved with Edna Strickland. Then you appear a third time and pretend to be my friend just so you can yank the rug out from under me and send me sprawling into the dirt. Okay, I can work with that. I love you, Sonny Crockett. Or is that even your real name? Uh, sure it is. Of course it is. Well, it's a dumb name. 
Then I guess I'm dumb for getting all worked up over somebody with such a dumb name. Ok, en fait, mon vrai nom, c'est... Ouais, je suis obligé de donner mon vrai nom. Marty! My name is Marty! Oh, so everything you've told me has been a lie. More or less. Why? Why did you ruin my life? J'ai fait ça par plaisir. I did it for fun. You ruined my life for fun? Yeah, that's how I get my kicks. You bastard. And all that time you spent building up my dreams telling me I was going to be a great scientist. Yeah, what a laugh. Dreams are only for people with guts enough to follow them. You're saying I don't have guts? You? <laughs> Look at you. What do you know? A person like you? You don't know the first thing about me. I have more dreams in my little finger than you'll ever have. Hey, daydreams don't count. Daydreams? That's what they said to Edison. That's what they said to Einstein. That's what they said to Dr. Frankenstein. Yeah, and look what they accomplished. I'm sick of people telling me what I can and can't do. First my father, then Edna, now you. Listen to me, good. From now on, I'm living my life my way. I'm taking my own advice and I'm following my own ideas. My ideas. Do you hear me? My ideas. It's Scott. I've got it. Got what? The solution. My invention. I know how to make it work. Mental alignment meter? No, no, my airborne personal transport device. The rocket car? Not rockets, not rockets at all. That was my mistake. The basic idea was sound, but the propulsion system was unworkable. But the lightning, the lightning! Suddenly the answer is clear. It came to me all at once, like... Like a bolt of lightning? Exactly! Static electricity! Super high and high static electricity powering the asynchronous oscillation of frictionless plates inside the what's this stupid thing doing on my head? Damn it! Yeah, you you're you again! Here I've been wasting my time with silly mind reading tricks when there's serious science to be done. <gasps> and the expo begins at eight! <laughs> Let's get the hell out of here before anything else happens. What? I said, let's get out of here before anything. Et là, c'est le drame. Il faut sauver Emmett. I can't reach him. Emmett's helmet. I don't think he needs it now. Faut que je détache la statue. It's not going anywhere. Comment je fais déjà? Ah, mais je suis bête. Faut que je remonte. Hold on! I wasn't planning on doing anything else. Faut que je parle à Emmett. Emmett! What? I'm sorry I had to get you so upset. See, I figured you needed to... Forget it! This isn't the time for long-winded explanations. Je vous aider à finir I'll help you finish your new invention. Great! The first step is to get me down from here! Can you climb up? I'm afraid I can't find a convenient purchase for my upper limbs. What? No handhold! Got anything useful on you? Only my wallet. Oh, and this portable anti-stick, anti-stain formula. Don't. Got any ideas for me? I think I used up my quota for the day. I'm sorry about you and Edna. Water over the bridge. Now get me down from here. Hang in there. Very funny. No. Oh. Alors descendre. Hop, et il faut que je récupère le spray de nettoyant. Emmett solution. This stuff's dangerous. Hop, je m'en sers sur la corde. Voilà. Ensuite, il faut que je remonte. Hang in there. 
I don't have a choice. Hop, la corne. Et là, je me balance sur la corde. Allez, vas-y, balance-toi, Marty. Mais, putain. Faut que je clique ou... Mais faut que je clique. Euh, non, faut que j'appuie sur les flèches. Mais voilà, ça marche cette fois. Let's get out of here. Your pants, they're stuck. Do something before we're crushed. Donc là, faut que j'utilise juste le spray. What are you doing? Trust me. Hold on. What did you say voilà. your name was again? Marty. Marty. Thanks. Don't mention it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <sighs> <sighs> The catalyst will need to be made out of tungsten given the temperature within a convertible node I'll be intense. We'll have to harvest the filaments from all the light bulbs in my house. Your invention? You think you can finish it before the end of the expo? Think? I've got to. My future depends on it. Then let's go. Of course, the oscillating plates will need to be calibrated precisely. Even the slightest misalignment could cause the magnetic field to fluctuate in intensity, leading to sudden shifts in polarity. The results could conceivably be catastrophic. Ah, who cares? My thought exactly. Science should be messy and unpredictable, or else where's the fun of it? Need a lift? Mr. Sagan, got the kinks worked out of your car of the future? Oh, well, not all of them, but at least the DeLorean's Monday terrestrial functionality remains intact. As usual, I have not the slightest idea what you're talking about. In fact, you remind me of someone... Someone I used to... <laughs> there, there, my dear, don't worry. I'm sure we'll all turn out well in the end. Maybe for everyone else, but I suddenly feel very much like someone who's going to be alone and unloved for a very long time. Maybe I should get a cat. Nonsense. I can state with nearly 100% certainty you're going to have a long and fulfilling life. How can you know that? I think you'll find I know almost everything worth knowing about you and young Emmett. And his friends. Tell me, how much do you know about Sonny Crockett? Voilà qui n'est pas très bon. Ça n'augure rien de bon. Hmm, libre à vous de voir la preview. Ou pas. Let me explain it again. I realized that it wasn't Edna that made my life miserable. It was science. She used my science to turn Hill Valley into a police state. If Emmett doesn't go through with a demonstration at the expo, his dreams of being a scientist will dip just enough for Edna to step back into his life and steer him down another path. Doc. Et voilà. C'était Double Vision. Le prochain épisode sera le dernier. Enfin, le prochain épisode, euh, je parle en épisode de jeu, hein, comme d'habitude. Donc, euh, en tout cas, je vous remercie d'avoir regardé cette série de vidéos et à bientôt pour un prochain épisode du walkthrough de Retour vers le futur.